All right, welcome back to my channel. So today we are talking about headlight restoration kits and getting rid of the fog and discoloration of headlights that are on our 2014 BMW. So you can see that they're foggy and so you don't get a lot of clarity out of the light, which means that you're gonna not get as much light on the road, which makes it unsafe. So uh, this is a $20 kit you can buy on Amazon. Uh, Sylvania makes this one. It comes with great reviews and that sort of thing. It's supposed to be three easy steps into doing this. Basically, you put a surface uh, activator on it, which is supposed to get some of the, the, basically the yellowness out of it. You leave that on for a little bit. Then you do three different steps of sanding. You use a 400 grit sandpaper, a 1000 grit sandpaper, and a 2000 grit sandpaper for about five minutes each for both headlights. And then finally, you do a finish and a seal coat with a UV protector on it. So we're gonna see what they do for these um, and uh, see if we can get rid of some of this, this surface cracking and the yellowness that you see in the headlights. So everything, the sandpapers, the, the surface activator, the clear coat, everything comes in this little box um, with a couple little rags to it, but it doesn't come with painter's tape. And what I wanted to do is make sure that I didn't get, it didn't scuff any of the paint. So I used painter's tape, I taped off any of the paint surfaces so I didn't scuff it. The, the contents of this box, the, the different things like the surface activator and things like that, uh, none of that is supposed to affect your paint or do anything to your paint, um, but the little bit of sandpaper that you do along the edges, you wanna make sure that you don't scuff your paint or anything like that, so this is a good way to do that. The first step is to put the surface activator on, so you're gonna spray this generously on, on the headlights. You don't wanna use all of it because you're gonna use it later in a further step down the road, but you're gonna spray this on, leave it on for 30 seconds, then you have to completely rinse the light off uh, to get rid of all the corrosion and that sort of thing of it. So. So one suggestion I have is you're gonna basically get sandpaper and it comes in one sheet. So basically I split it down the middle. So I have one set for the left headlight, one set for the right headlight. That they tell you just to fold it over, but you wanna make sure that you have enough uh, to do proper sanding on both sides and you don't wanna use it all up. So um, ripped them in half, one for each headlight. Okay, you're gonna start with the 400 grit sandpaper, which is the most coarse and it says in the back, you'll see it. And you basically wanna wet the complete headlight and for five minutes you're gonna sand in a circular motion uh, with this and complete and continue to wet the, both the sandpaper and the headlight as you go. Okay, after sanding, you're gonna to wanna to rinse and then dry the lights out. And they're gonna be super foggy. So, but you wanna check and make sure it's all smooth. You don't wanna be basically pock marks in it or anything like that from any road, things that come off the road, rocks, things like that. Okay, the next step is after you dry your headlights completely, after the 400 grit's done, uh, you should see white hazy headlights that look terrible. So just so you know, they're gonna look terrible. And then you're gonna move on and do a thousand grit sandpaper, five minutes doing the exact same thing. Keep it wet, keep the headlights wet. And basically you're gonna go back over everything again with a thousand grit. And what you're doing is you're reducing surface, surface scratches. So 400 is the most coarse you're gonna have, thousands less coarse, so you're gonna get less scratches. And then you're gonna move on to the 2000. Now we're on to 2000 grit sandpaper, same thing. Wet the lights really good, wet the sandpaper really good, keep it wet, so keep rinsing it and that sort of thing. Five minutes, both headlights. Okay, now that the sanding is done, um, I'm going on to the clarifying compound, step two. So you're gonna use one white towel. Clarifying compound comes in this little thing. You can use half of this on one light. You can use the other half on the other light. And uh, basically you can use the same white towel. So they must have another step with the white towel. So only use one of the white towels. Okay, we finished the compound, rubbing the compound on for five minutes. Um, and now we're completely drying them off. Next step is you're gonna reapply the surface um, activator. So one last time, so you're gonna put that over each light for 30 seconds, then you're gonna completely rinse the lights again.
Then you're gonna thoroughly rinse the lights. Okay, now it's time to remove the tape. And again, this is just protective tape for where you were sanding. So remove all your tape. It should come off pretty easy because there's a lot of wetness into it. So just keep removing it all. Then you're gonna thoroughly dry the headlights, thoroughly dry it so that the clear coat, the next step of this, really sticks. So you're gonna make sure they're completely dried up. You're gonna use the second white towel they gave you, and this is how big it is, to make sure you get every bit of moisture and everything off because you want you want that last clear coat to bond really, really well to the light. Okay, last step, UV block and clear coat. Step three, they give you one applicator glove. They give you the blue towel. You have to start at the top of the light, even strokes, and you cannot reapply this. So try not to miss a spot and uh, go over from top of the light all the way to the bottom of the light in as thick a coat as you possibly can. Okay, so we finished up. You gotta let it sit for about four to six hours. Do not touch it, do not drive it, do not do anything to it, do not let it get rained on. So don't put it in direct sunlight. They say not to do that as well. If we're in a nice shaded area, nice breezy area, and there's no, no rain in sight. So do that, let it sit, and you're done. So that's it. So basically, this is the headlight restoration. You can see we got rid of all the yellow or in, and kind of the oranging of the light. Uh, we got rid of that. You can see how nice and clear it is. It still has a little bit of cracking, little surface cracking and stuff of like that in some spots, but we put on a nice clear coat to it and it looks really, really good. It's pretty much the best you're going to do for um, a do-it-yourself type kit for $20. Um, otherwise, you can have it done professionally. Um, generally, they'll try to take your bumper off to get your headlights out to make it easier for themselves to put clear coating on, things like that. And it's usually $175, $200 per light, so you're talking $400 versus $20. So, and you can see, they look pretty damn near crystal clear. Um, so one's better than the other, but one light was a little bit better than the other in this car. So it really depends on uh, how bad each light is. And uh, I put a little bit more work on the other one, but it's still a little bit different, just a little bit off. But subscribe to our channel. I'll put a link in the description below. You can buy it on Amazon for $20.